I am Alan Kinna. I am a certified rigger. The rigger's responsibilities are to inspect the rigging, know the working capacity, and to properly attach it to the load. Here I will explain a few major considerations for inspecting the rigging. Inspecting the rigging. Number one, knots and kinks reduce lifting capacity 50%. Here we have a rope with a knot in it. It reduces the lifting capacity 50%. We cannot use it in rigging. Number two, hooks must have a hook latch. Here we have a hook with the hook latch. Here we have a hook without a hook latch. We cannot use this in rigging. Number three, no loops with U-bolts. Here they have made a loop using U-bolts. We cannot use this in rigging. Number four, no bolted together or welded together. Here we have a chain that was too short and they used a bolt to make it longer. We cannot use this in rigging. Number five, no tears of frays and slings. Here we have a torn sling, it's frayed. We cannot use this in rigging. Number six, all chains and slings must have a tag. Here we have a sling without a tag, a chain without a tag. They have been taken off. We cannot use these in rigging. Number seven, grade eight or T steel only. Here we have a sling that has a latch, but it is not grade eight, so we cannot use it in rigging. Thank you.